ears can't hear the sound of the tongue. Reach the skies, we'll fly up to the moon. I know we'll be there soon. Wait and see. Hello, everyone. Today I am talking all about spring summer fashions. I ordered several items from Goelia and I am so excited to show them to you. In fact, I was so excited to wear them. I've worn several of them already to lunch out with my husband and to lunch out with a girlfriend. So I was really worried about don't get anything on them because I still have to show them to you. I did well, but the good news is all of them are easy care. You can wash them at home, hand wash, line dry, some are machine dry or machine wash line dry. And Goelia is sponsoring this video. So they have offered us a 10% off code. I will put the code on the screen. It is, I'm not sure what it, I, I always get it backwards, whether the 10 is before my initials or after. So I will put it on the screen so I do not make a mistake, but it does offer you 10% off and it's combinable with other specials going on on their sites. It's really amazing savings. I think you will notice that as soon as you go to the site. Something else I noticed was how pretty and feminine the pieces are and also how ladylike. What I mean by that is everything is understated and not overdone. The necklines are not overly plunging. The skirts or shorts are not overly short. I have 12 items I'm going to be showing you today. I think I will start with tops. My first top is this pretty V-neck blouse. This is so comfortable, but can be dressed up or dressed down. All I have to do is roll up the sleeves, put on a pair of jeans, and I have dressed up the jeans and sort of dressed down the top. Now this is a versatile V neckline and it doesn't plunge too low, but you'll also note there is a necklace here. This comes with the blouse. It's actually attached to little loops underneath. It has pleating here and here, which gives it a soft drape, very, very slight puffy shoulders, which again, soften it. And the softening effect here and here just gives it such a romantic feminine look. To go with the pearl necklace detail, it has pearl buttons at the cup. This is 100% polyester, hand wash, line dry, so simple to care for. Fitted in the shoulders, but the body is more of a loose fit. So it's so comfortable in this hot, weather. The next top, I also ordered my regular size of extra, extra small or zero. It is this pretty mulberry silk puff sleeve, short sleeve blouse. I would say this is a peasant style and the color is a light beige. Beautiful. You can see how it looks against my winter white top here. Fitted nicely in the shoulders, but roomy in the body. So you're not confined. It's beautiful weight of silk. And because it is not tight fitting, it's perfect for hot weather. Now these buttons are sewn on. There's no opening here. The opening is simply at the neckline. So you can make it demure like this or untie this and just loop it and you can make it more plunging to be more flirty. You can wear this with shorts looks so cute with shorts and flat sandals, or of course, dress it up. Also beautiful with white jeans. The next blouse I want to show you also is silk. I believe it's a blend or is it? Maybe it's 100% silk. Let me look here. Now this is 12 mom mulberry silk. It's 100% silk. In fact, it comes with a camisole that is also 100% silk. Isn't that great? So you don't have to worry about what to wear underneath. Look at that lovely, lovely neckline. It is a 
small ruffle collar neckline with a bow tie, long sleeves with a slight tiny little ruffle at the sleeve, and look at this fabric. It has a slight texture to it, just gorgeous, and see how beautifully sheer it is. So your arms are not lined, they're sheer, and then all this part is sheer, but then you have the camisole. And what's wonderful about the camisole is it's adjustable. So you can make the length of the straps as long or short as you wish. I love the look of it tied in a pretty bow with the tassels falling down like this. Look at these tassels. They're actually individual flowers made out of the same fabric and each one topped with a tiny gold bead all the way down. That is just amazing detail. So pretty. So, so pretty. You can opt to wear it like this or of course untie it and just loop the strings to make it more casual. This also will tie up tighter. You can wear it like this. I'm just showing it like this. I ordered this blouse in an extra small. I wanted to size up because I wanted the length. I'm very tall in the torso. So that's what's nice about this particular blouse. You can size up or down. So if for some reason they are out of your normal size or regular size, I think it would be safe to size up or down because it's a generous fit and there's no seam on the shoulders. This looks beautiful worn out because see, it's finished on a bottom in a smile hem, meaning the hem goes like this, or you can tuck it in, definitely can tuck it in. This would look so pretty with linen trousers, white linen trousers and the blouse worn out, or with white skinny jeans, the blouse worn out, or tuck the front in and wear the back out, or tuck the whole blouse in. The other thing that's so fun is because the cuffs are elasticized, you can pull it up to over your elbow and you can create a shorter sleeve, three quarter sleeve. My next blouse is this classic timeless ruffle neck tie blouse, always in fashion, always in style, ruffle detail on the cuffs, button cuff here, button front, with pearl and gold buttons that are so pretty. Even if you do not typically wear dressy items or you have a very casual lifestyle, I'm telling you, it is so fun to have a few dressy tops in your wardrobe, because especially if they're comfortable, not tight, and this isn't, it's generous in the body, fitted in the shoulders so it is nicely tailored and refined but it dresses up a pair of simple jeans so well, and yet you're still comfortable. If you want, you can even roll up the sleeves, but the sleeves with the ruffle cuff are so pretty down as well. If you roll up the sleeves, you still have the pretty ruffle detail here, and of course the tie neck. You don't need to tie this in a bow. You can leave it like this, loose, or tie it in a low bow, or tie it up here in a bow. It really is quite versatile and you can always wear something like this with a nice pair of trousers to church or to a function at a family's home where you want to be a little bit dressed up but you want to still be comfortable. So you wear casual trousers on the bottom like jeans and then you have this dressy top to make the outfit more refined, but it's very comfortable because it's not tight fitting. See, it's just a very subtle ruffle. You can see it all the way around. Also on the cuff, pearl button. Here it 
guys. Here's the tie. Tell you this fabric looks so luxurious and so high end. You see the arms are a bit more sheer than the body, which is wonderful detail. So you can see a hint of arm, but you don't have to worry about anything showing underneath this part because this is thicker. It's very easy to care for. It resists wrinkles as well. Speaking of that, everything I'm showing you today, I used a steamer. In fact, I will put on screen my steamer. I have had this for quite a few years. I swear by it. It is not that expensive. It's so easy. It's small, compact. So even if you live in a small space, it does not take up a lot of room. I use purified or distilled water so it doesn't clog up. And it's so wonderful. I have taken to steaming most everything in my wardrobe. I keep most of my t-shirts and cardigans and sweaters folded. So it's quick. I just hang them on plastic hangers on the shower rod in our bathroom and steam them. It's so much faster for me than ironing. The only thing I ironed was the two cotton pants I will be showing you and a collar of one of the blouses. I'll show you that, but otherwise steam. The next top I want to show you is the one I'm wearing. It is a combination of silk and elastane. It is very comfortable. It's like wearing a cloud. In fact, all the silk blouses are like wearing a cloud. They're the perfect weight for keeping you cool, but also still hiding whatever you have underneath. You don't have to worry about something showing. And the one that is more sheer, of course, has its matching silk camisole, the blush top. You can easily dress this up because it is silk, but also you can dress it down. It would look adorable with shorts. Simply tie up the waist or tuck in, but you can tie up the waist, put on a pair of Bermuda shorts or shorter shorts, pair of tennis shoes or sandals, beautiful. Or of course you can dress it up. The next item I want to show you is this silk light camel color blazer. I love that it is not lined because then it doesn't make me hot. It makes the jacket more lightweight. It drapes beautifully but it gives just that light extra layer that I sometimes want. It looks beautiful worn on the shoulders if you want just in case you need it when you go inside, but you don't want to be hot outside. I love draping my cardigans and my blazers over my shoulder. And then when I get inside, depending on the temperature, I can either leave it that way or put the jacket or the cardigan on. What I loved about this blazer is it is a longer length and I took the size extra small rather than my normal extra, extra small because I wanted the length. Again, my torso is long, so I wanted the jacket to be as long as possible. The shoulders are slightly padded, but not overdone, which is why this is a classic blazer. You can wear this year after year because they have not made the shoulders overly wide. It is one button, so you can wear it buttoned or unbuttoned. But what makes this so interesting is it came with a button-in camisole or vest. And this also is 100% silk. By the way, all the silk items I'm showing you, including these, are hand wash and line dry. You do not have to take them to the dry cleaners. So here is the button-in camisole. You can wear it with the more matte side or the more shiny side, either one. So here's a loop. You button this under the shoulder and then you have these buttonholes here all the way down and you button those in there. See? Right there are the buttons. I have been searching, searching, searching for white pants for probably the last two summers at least. And I wanted pants that I didn't have to worry about whatever I was wearing underneath showing. I have plenty of lovely trousers and pants that are slimmer fitting. So I do need to wear tighter, you know, control top 
under things <laughs> and seamless because they're so slim fitting. But I also wanted in my wardrobe a pair of good white trousers that could be dressy or casual that were cotton, definitely cotton. And oh my goodness, I hit the gold mine at Goelia because I found two, one with pleated front and one without. And I'm going to show you the pleated front first. They are wide leg. Now I believe they say these are, let me check, are oil resistant. Let me look here, hold on. Wide leg, pleated front. They're size 27. I chose my normal size of 27. Yes, it says they're made from an oil resistant fabric and the fabric is 54% 54 cotton, 22% polyester, 13% lyocell, 10% viscose, and 1% elastane. So for some reason that combination makes them resistant to oil. Now I have worn these already out <laughs> and I did not get anything on them so I didn't have to test it, but that's what the description says. So that's wonderful. They are machine wash, line dry. These are white, but they're not that optic white. They're more of a soft white. As I said, they do have a pleated front. They have deep pockets here, I'll show you. And then they have faux besom pockets on the back, which is a pretty detail. Here's the back. And they do have a wide leg. Ah, oh, they are so comfortable. They're like wearing pajamas, probably because of the blend of the fabric. They're just gorgeous. Now they call them jeans online. The two cotton pants I'm going to show you, they do call them jeans, but I think that is doing them a disservice. These are so gorgeous. They look like trousers, but they have the comfort of jeans and they can be dressed down to be worn like jeans. But because both of them are a looser fit in the legs, they're so comfortable. They're cool in the summer. We get very hot very humid weather here and this is the exact type of pant I do want to wear. You can pair these with sandals, you can wear them with ballet flats. Now I love having the choice of either a flat front or a pleated front because they are a completely different looking pair of pants. So here is that other pair of white pants with the flat front. So you see completely different looking still that soft white color. The fabric content is 93% cotton, 6% polyester, 1% elastane, machine wash, line dry. Did I tell you that? The others are also machine wash, line dry, size 27, size 27. That's my normal size. So I would say order what you would normally order in jeans or trousers. As for the fit, they fit, they're not tight in the hips. They just fitted. That's what I also love. Jeans tend to be a tighter fit. They call these jeans, but these are the fit of a slim fit trouser, which I love, which is why they look so refined. These are the flat front. They have no pockets on the sides, giving that streamlined look. They do have nice pockets on the back, real pockets. These are a slimmer leg, but these are still a generous leg, which I love. I, that's one reason why I don't have to worry about what I wear underneath. Here's the two of them next to each other. They're both wonderful. I recommend getting both so that you have always a pair of pants, clean and ready to wear, but they also are completely different looking. These are much wider leg, but both of them drape beautifully and soft as pajamas. Thick, luxuriously thick cotton. I don't know why more brands don't make white pants with this kind of thick cotton. It is a cotton blend. I absolutely love both of these trousers. What I love about the pleated ones, going back to these, is that the pleating is below your belly. It's not, they're not adding bulk to your belly. See, it's flatter around your stomach. See, here's the, the it starts to open up, the pleats start to open up 
down at the bottom of the zipper here. So over your belly, it's smooth. And of course, with the flat front, it's smooth all the way down, all the way down. The third pair of white pants I wanted to show you is this dressy pleated front pant. These are gorgeous on. They have no belt loops, which is wonderful because you don't have to worry about matching the color of white to these pants. And the other thing I love is the back is subtly elasticized. You do not really see this once you put the pants on because they look fitted once you have them on. It does have faux besom pockets in the back. There are no pockets in the front, so it gives that very streamlined look, but softened by these very small pleats. That's what makes them so feminine and romantic looking. They have a wide leg, and the drape on these also is just lovely. Look at that, look at that. I think it's a good idea to have at least one pair of dressy white pants in your wardrobe. You never know when you'll need them. Even if you're not somebody who likes to get dressed up, they work beautifully for any occasion where you just want to be a little bit more refined, a little bit more dressy. You don't have to put much effort into your outfit at all. You throw these trousers on, a nice white blouse, and maybe if it's chilly, a little cardigan over your shoulders, and you have a lovely outfit. You can wear that to church. You can wear that to a church function. You can wear it to a, an event at someone's home where you want to look pretty and a bit dressed up, but you don't want to have to worry about what you're wearing. Even if you spill something on this, it is a polyester blend, so it's easy to wash. They look beautiful with navy or with black. If you wear a navy top, a black top, look pretty with pink or, of course, white or off-white. If you want to make them a bit more casual, you can tie your blouse at the waist. And again, you don't have to worry about a belt. You just need to worry about shoes and what shoes to wear. A little sandal in gold or off-white would look so pretty with this, or a ballet flat. These are a longer length, so you'll want to probably hem them if you don't have long legs. I wore these with high heels, but they're easy to get hemmed. You can just take them to your seamstress and hem them, or opt to wear them with heels. Something I didn't mention is I did decide to size up. I got a size 28 when I'm normally a 27. In both the cotton pants, I'm wearing a size 27. These, because of the elasticized back, I thought I could probably do that. And sure enough, I'm so glad I did. It gives them more of a looser fit in the hips and thighs, which is what I wanted. So you might consider doing that if you want the same kind of look I was going for, or just go with your regular size. My last pair of trousers I wanted to show you, I loved the way they looked online, but I really wasn't prepared for how much I would love them in person. The fabric is so unusual. It is 100% silk, but let me check my notes because it is a different kind of silk. The name of it is spelled X-I-A-N-G, and then the second word is Y-U-N. And I believe that's Shang Yun, Shang Yun. It's a Chinese non-heritage cultural treasure according to the online description, made of mulberry silk, dyed by pure plants, and made by a unique ancient method. Softness, breathability, and wrinkle-free durability make it the perfect choice to wear. Now, I will say yes, yes, and yes. Soft, breathable, durable in terms of wrinkles. I have worn these already, and absolutely love them. I don't know if you can see, they have a sheen to them, but there is a design in them that's naturally derived from the process. See that fabric? It is so beautiful. You can see why it is so loved. And they have a high waist and the waist is fitted. Then they widen around the hip and are looser, they're not tight, and then they have a wider leg. 
I wore these to lunch with a white top and a sweater tied around my neck and I wore ballet flats, black ballet flats. Absolutely love them. I love the deep pockets. They're just so comfortable for summer because they're looser fitting. They're also hand wash, line dry, so you do not have to get them dry cleaned. Love that. I forgot to mention in the black pants, I did choose my regular size, which is a size 27. Now I want to show you this dress. Oh my goodness, this was a surprise to me as well. This is the color sand, I would say, and it is a midi dress. I think they call it a maxi, but I would say it's a midi, not a maxi. It is mid, you know, it's under, below the knee, but not to the ankles. Unless you were petite, then it would be a maxi. It has a gathered waist, so it's elasticized all the way around. Now I ironed it so that the neck line is open, but you can wear it buttoned, which is how they show it online, which I'll show you on the screen. Has pockets on the front. These are real pockets. And it has very deep, wonderful pockets in the skirt, which I love. Speaking of the skirt, it is so wide and flowy. I loved all the fabric in this skirt. It is, makes it just so feminine. And because of the longer length, it's so comfortable and cool. It's nipped in at the waist, but everything else, it's roomy. So it's perfect for summer, for hot days. It's 100% acetate, but the fabric looks like a linen up close. I steamed it. Everything, in fact, I steamed. They were so easy, except for the two cotton pants. I did iron those, and then I did iron this down because I liked it open. You can show jewelry or not, but you can wear it buttoned up. It's up to you, especially in the hot weather because it's sleeveless. I definitely recommend this. You can wear this with cardigans. You can wear it under a blazer. You can wear it with flats. You can wear it with kitten heels, or you can dress it up with higher heels and more dressy jewelry. Now, I ordered a size small, which is not my typical size. Again, I'm an extra, extra small, but I wanted the looser fit. I also wanted the length because my torso is so long. So this is another one of those items that you don't have to worry about getting your exact size if it's not available or you can size up or size down if you like a, li a looser or tighter fit. You can wear this with or without a belt. I did wear it in the video I'll be showing you or in the clip I'll be showing you at the end of the video. I do show it with a belt, but you do not have to wear it with a belt. Not at all. You can wear it without. The last item I want to show you is my favorite in the whole collection. It is this silk polka dot skirt. It is a midi length below the knee, a line, and it's just so lovely. I did not know how much I would love it until I put it on actually. When I saw it in the mirror, I thought, oh my goodness, this is not what I expected. I knew I liked the style and I liked the small polka dots, but there's something about the way it drapes on the body that makes it so feminine. It's almost like it has a, I don't know, like a, a flip to it because of the material. Now it is, it has a slip underneath that is built in, so you don't have to worry about wearing a slip, see? And it just, I don't know what they've done, but the way they've cut it or something makes it fit so beautifully. And then the subtle detail of the polka dot, which is a timeless pattern, but it does happen to be on trend this summer. You will see polka dots all the time. Doesn't matter if they're trending or not. They never go out of style. It is a winter white or ivory. Oh, it's just so pretty. Let me check on the makeup of the silk. I think it's 100% silk. Let me look, hold on. Oh no, it's 92% silk, mulberry silk, and 8% elastane. It's 22 mom silk, so maybe that has something to do with why it drapes the way it does and flows and flips at the end when you walk. Oh my goodness, it's just so feminine. 
But what surprised me and I did not realize is it comes with this little pouch and in this pouch are three items. A brooch or a, a hairpin, you can use it as either. It's a three-dimensional rose made out of the same fabric. I will show these to you up close in a moment. You get a silk scrunchie made out of the same fabric and then this. You get a headband made out of the very same fabric. So let me show you these. Oh my goodness. So here is the headband. So it twists on top. You put this underneath your hair or at the nape of your neck and you put this on the top. See? Then here is the scrunchie. And here's the pretty rose. Now you can, they'll show you online, they have clipped the rose to the top of the waistband, but you could also clip it in your hair because it is a clip, not a pin. Isn't that brilliant? But look at the workmanship. All of this comes with this skirt. And look at that fabric. Look at that soft sheen. It's pearlescent. And it does have a little bit of stretch because of the blend. So this looks lovely paired with black, obviously, and with off-white and acru and ivory. You could dress this down, again, with a white crew neck t-shirt and black sandals, flat sandals, and you're good to go. And then just pop this little bow, oh, bow, this little rose here at the waist if you want some detail, but you don't even, even need that. You can just, have you ever seen where you knot a t-shirt so you don't have to tuck it in? I would knot the t-shirt and wear it with a skirt. A black t-shirt would look pretty. And black sandals or ivory sandals or gold flat sandals. This is romantic, this is elegant. It can easily be dressed up or dressed down. This, if you love feminine and ladylike, this skirt is that category. It is timeless. It is classic. In fact, all of these items I showed you today are timeless. They're classic. They don't go out of style. They're also comfortable and they're easy to wear. Coming up next, I will show you everything in outfits. Again, thank you so much for watching my video and I will talk to you in my next one. Bye.